Joel Hickerson, Grindog.com. We're going to draw a funny monkey. All right, starting out, what's going to make this monkey funny? Uh, we still want to remember the construction elements of our monkey, which the muzzle is going to be a big circle, and we're going to put the head behind that. Now we come up with elements that might make this monkey a funny monkey. Well, one thing that might do it is if he was really surprised about something. And when I draw a surprised monkey or even a human face, it's always cool to put a little asterisk where their mouth is and maybe a bottom lip. Don't forget the basic construction elements of their eyes. And now he's probably looking at something that's surprised him. And when you draw a surprised monkey, you draw the hair up and out, kind of almost like an exploding out. Everything's exploding out. And then maybe his hands are up against his face. Ooh, like, oh my goodness, something just happened then, man. And then uh, every funny monkey, you got to draw their booty. So we draw a little funky monkey butt. And some feet. And again, these are construction elements. So what we're going to do when we get done with the construction elements, we're going to come back with our marker and make them make sense. All right, so we'll start with the eye. And the, the wackier, the better. These eyes don't have to be symmetrical. This is a cartoon, so really exaggerate things. Again, the mouth doesn't even have to follow the same asterisk lines that you just had. You get a little shadow under that bottom lip and draw the muzzle. And now you can kind of see it starting to shape up. The hands don't even have to really look like hands. They just need to be out there. Uh, kind of framing his face. And the monkey butt speaks for itself. Little tail coming out. One foot, two feet, belly, bottom of the muzzle, back of the head. And remember, a monkey has got ears. That is one of the monkey. Things that makes him a monkey is if you really exaggerate the ears on him. And the surprise element, keep the hair kind of flying off the head. You can even do raised eyebrows. That might help. And uh, that's basically the construction part of your monkey. And then you can come back with your uh, eraser. Erase your construction lines. Now remember to draw very lightly with the pencil so that these construction lines come off easily. You don't really have to bear down so hard. And once you get the construction lines erased, you can come back and make shadows where you need shadows, like at the base of the ears. You want to give this thing a little bit of gravity. So at the bottom of all these elements, I'm going to give it a, a little thicker line. Should there be anything you want to really stand out, come back and draw a little heavier. I should surprise you always want to kind of get, do the outside of the eyes. And you might want a couple of sweat lines coming off of it. <laughs> <laughs> and that's a funny monkey.